So if any of you by any chance missed the last episode, let me explain something. I don't even know what to say. Guys, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. I think in this video, we're going to finalize the second trial and move on into the next big chapter of the game, in which I believe we should also experience a different season, possibly winter. Uh, and that's going to be upon completing the next main quest we're going to do here. But before we do that, I wanted to do a main quest that I've been wanting to do for the last couple of episodes. But, you know, some of the classes are starting to rack up and some of the other side quests as well. And I don't want to leave too much of that behind. So I wanted to do this one, which sounds really interesting. The Tale of Roland Oaks. Okay. So she seems worried about someone. I should speak with her. We are going to be using the Hippogriff here, of course, in this video. It's just, uh, oh, wow. I don't think I've been here during the uh, season. This looks so, so nice. Very nicely decorated. All right. Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumours that goblins may have been involved, well... I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? I would be worried. I think you're right to be concerned, Adelaide. Your uncle may be in trouble. You're much more understanding than Professor Weasley. She heard I was going to look for him and forbade me from leaving the grounds. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Ugh. Could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. <laughs> Absolutely. But first, a couple of questions. I take it you and your uncle are close. We are. My mother died when I was born, and I lost my father when I was five. Uncle Roland's looked after me for as long as I can remember. He knows I get anxious when he travels, and that's why he sends me all the owls, to let me know that he's all right. Okay. Has your uncle traded with many goblins? Yes, for ages. Even speaks gobbledygook. But he only recently mentioned... Ranrock's lot. Insisting the galleons were worth the risk. He does it for me. Between robes and supplies, attending Hogwarts costs a fair sickle. And besides that, Uncle Roland has expensive taste. He's sacrificed so much for me over the years. I promised him that as soon as I finish Hogwarts, I shall be the one taking care of him. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Well, she's really nice. All right. The Tale of Rolling Oaks. I mean... Let's go! Come, come on, on high wing. Pass the high wing! If you think I'm not going to use this right now, you are crazy. I pressed ominous regarding Salazar Slytherin Scriptorium, but my efforts were in vain. Meet me outside the Slytherin common room. We need to talk. Outside the Slytherin common room. Interesting. Woohoo! Wow, dude. Now right, we're here. Could this be Mr. Briggs? Man rocks the list. Just ahead. Be uh. 
Hold on, guys. Uh, You're really not very good at this, are you? Uh, can I not land? <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Having some technical difficulties here. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. How dare you! Bastards. Heck yeah. Hold on. Yes, but I was I was saying that I want to rearrange all my spells. So they all kind of have uh, the same page. So I have all the spells in the same page, if that makes any sense. Get out of here. Now to find out what happened here. Confrego, Repulso. I don't know. I think uh, those enchantments and words we say as we whip our wand across enemy faces is pretty self satisfying. Rebellion. All right, so there's a wall with a mystery on it. If I've ever seen one. Oh, explosive! Nice. A new traits. A journal. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. Van Rock's lot agreed to meet, but I do feel a tad uneasy. They amended their request and were angry when I asked questions. I overheard some of their plan and gobbledygook. I remember he speaks the language a bit. They're after my rare metal deposits that are suitable for drilling. I'm afraid of upsetting them further. They seem rather volatile, and I need this distraction to happen. Perhaps we can work out a compromise. Perhaps not. Uh, they talk. Adelaide said that her uncle kept notes of his trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. Hmm. So there's a tent up top, and then follow a trail or river. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Well, this already feels dangerous, but you know, I'm all for the danger. Oh, wow. Oh, a Quidditch uniform. That's cool, man. Okay, how do I get to these goblins? There's like goblins up top. I guess we just got to use the map at this point. We've got to go north. Oh, those are not goblins. Those are not. Oh, God. That's right. Oh, yes. Let's go. Rebellion. This is the dungeon here. What do we have in here? Confringo. Incendio. Lumos. There we go. It's just light, that's all. Not fire. Just light. In the world Rebellion. Is what the heck? Ooh. A forest scarf. All that for that. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go use the map. We got to use this map to find out this man's location. Okay. So, here we are. If we go... Hmm, how am I going to find this place? Oh, hold on. Could that be his tent down there? And then there's the river, right? 
A rock formation. That's the first landmark on this map. Now to am find I going a crooked tree. Am I going crazy or? Hold I on. know what that means. Merlin trial. Rebellion. Repair. Hmm. Sweet. Rebellia. Just gotta repair all of these. Repair. Like so. That's right. Magic. Magic is awesome. <laughs> all right. So this is definitely uh, this is definitely the oh, river that leads to her uncle. Me. For sure. Alright, so the river is right here. I've pinned an area up top. Just to kind of center myself around this spot. I think it might actually be all the way back there. Yeah. Yeah, it's gotta be there. I'm gonna take off this marker because I think we found it. Yeah, almost certain it's there. Yes, sir. What do we have here? Seems quiet. Too quiet, if you ask me. All right, let's do this, bro. Let's get to work. Let's get to work. Ah. Alright. Let's hmm. do this. I may have more. Than I need you little punks. Let me fight with me. I blocked that, man. I was literally holding him even right before he did anything. Well, guess I tell you. Like that. Okay, where are the rest? I'm gonna go up top. <laughs> That's not gonna do anything for us. Yeah, look at ya. Look at ya. It's the students from the town. Akio, never seen a wizard. Like Old Come back here, buddy. Where do you think you're going, huh? There's another chest down below. There's also a flu flame, which I should probably unlock. A couple of chickens. Rebellion. Where's this, um like a chest here or something a ladder that's what i need hmm you think so Akio. Oh, no, it's down below somewhere some sort of crate oh ancient magic focus very nice all right here's the camp on the map we do not need a ladder my young padawan Incendio. We do not need a lot of. <laughs> if that's all you guys got, I kind of feel sorry for Rebellion. you. Where is this place, dude? Down below? There's more below. How do I get down below? Here we go. What's going on out there? Ooh. Hello, boys. I mean, goblins. Is that it? Akio. Uh huh. 
Easy peasy, I'm just too strong. You only have Ran Rock to blame. Doing Dune, do focused. Just have the Quidditch outfit on. That'd be pretty cool. Alright, so we're inside the ruins. Rebelling! To the Ooh, Goblin Outpost. Rebellion. You know what? I'm not, I'm not scared, man. Ain't nobody trying to stay hidden here. We can do this. What was that? It's punishment to us all to have that miserable human around. Miserable human? Are you kidding me? How dare you speak about me like that? Take the oh, the axe missed. Oh man, come on. You've been paying attention in defense against the dark hearts, I see. Come here. Come here, boy. That was cool. That's a level one unlock. Let's see what we have here. Alright, bada beam, bada boom. Hopefully there's something good in this chest. Oh, there's also a goblin here. Akio! Incendio! What a weakling! 43! Oh, come on, give me a break. A human's word is worthless. Shut up! Love that. There's that sneaky little student. That's the student who uses strange magic. Away, Satan! Yes. Man, the combat gets so fun. Just, just literally spamming spells. I'm kicking your ass in my Quidditch uniform. How about them apples? Bada bing, bada boom. Too late for you to learn the error of your ways. Revelio. It might just be too late indeed, my friends. Incendio. Nice. Oh, whoa. Rebellion. Really? <laughs> All right, let's go. Totally worth it if you ask me. Chest. Sneaky, sneaky, huh? Unidentified hand item. Wonder what that could be. Rebellion. That was a flawless execution. Rebellion. Hmm. 
Oh, my gears. Maybe we'll have to start taking away some of the hats. I think I have a lot of hats. Never mind. I have a lot of different styles of hats. Offer a bloody crap. Rebellious. Come on, man. Hello? Mr. Oaks? Yes, I'm here. They've taken my wand. This cell has an enchanted lock. I have experience with these locks, but I need my wand if I have any chance of opening it. Look for a boiler door. I've heard them speak of it. I need to find Mr. Oaks' wand. Where could it be? Boiler room or boiler door? Hmm. Rebellion. Hmm. Okay, how the hell do I do that? Hopefully. Ah. Incendio. Come on, boys. Come on, my boys. He said, I'm afraid of heights. Get out of here, man. Ah. Oh. All right. Stop it, little bastards. I've been fighting since before you were born. This doesn't hurt. Perfection. Die. A oh, blue flat cap, man. What in the world? Rebellion. There it is. This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. Oh, that's a cool wand. Perhaps now he can set himself free. All right, so we were, he was down here. Down here as well, and then straight through. No, thank me. Not thank Merlin. Merlin's not here. He's done nothing to help you. I did it all. <laughs> you did it. Oh, you found my wand and... Wait, you're a student? Oh, we must get you to safety immediately. It's dangerous. It's all right, Mr. Oaks. I've dealt with these goblins before. Dear Merlin, you're either very lucky or very talented. Well, how did you find me? I'm a friend of Adelaide's. She was worried about your business with Ranrock's loyalists. Oh, she was right to be. I couldn't go through with the agreement, and when I told them, I ended up blindfolded and behind bars. Been locked in that infernal cell for so long, they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasting goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. You're very welcome, sir. You mentioned you overheard things. <sighs> Sad tale, really. I think I know where Ramrock's unfortunate vendetta against wizardkind began. Although dragon breeding was outlawed by the Warlocks Convention of 1709, Ranrock stumbled upon an illegal dragon camp. He was young, found the creatures fascinating. He'd visit the camp in secret whenever he could, never making his presence known. 
After weeks of sly surveillance, he finally summoned the courage to speak to the wizard in charge. Ranrock wanted to join them and the creatures. The wizard happened to drop his wand. Ranrock saw an opportunity. He picked it up, went to hand it back as a, a means of introducing himself. The sight of a goblin with a wand sent the wizard into an instant rage. He beat Ranrock nearly to wow. death. Ever since, Ramrock has despised wizard kind, sees us all as cruel. Am I right that you speak gobbledygook? Unbeknownst to Ramrock's fiends, I do. I've always had an affinity for goblin culture. Knew I wanted to be a metal trader ever since I was a lad. It wasn't easy learning the language. It's, it's complex, and my memory's as weak as my knees these days. But after decades working with fine goblin folk, I grew fairly proficient. At least, I'd like to think so. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, <laughs> if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get back to Adelaide. I assure you, her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Alrighty. Mr. Oaks was lucky. Hanrock's lot would never have freed him. Hmm. We just got a handcrafted, uh... Really? Here it is. Oh, that's freaking cool, man. Handcrafted necklace. That's so cool. Alright, we are back in Hogwarts. Off to the map chamber. Which should be on the lower floor. We'll go through here. Oh, hello. Have I never gotten this? Oh, wow. Central Hall Fountain. Can't believe I never got that. Oh, just got a new talent point. It pays to be an explorer. Can I say? Alright, let's go. My goodness. Quite the walk, huh? Sheesh. Summoner's Court Match 1. Dude, have we ever been here? We probably have. It's just during the day or something. I don't know. Revelio. Yeah, we've been here. Yeah, we've been here. It's kind of crazy that we're coming here. Oh, because this is the main quest, right? So it's automatically pinning it. Let me just make sure, because... I think we're pinning it automatically. Yeah, that's what it... Man, that's what it was. Okay. I was gonna go to the room of requirement to Off on another adventure, oh. reveal some of the new stuff that we've gotten, but whatever. We're already here. Let's do the damn thing. You would be wise not to underestimate this student. Their aptitude for magic is beyond anything I've ever seen, and I've been teaching a long time. It is a joy to have such a student. It can be. There you are. You mean you didn't see me this, this this whole entire time? I've received your owl. I was able to speak with Lodgok, the goblin I mentioned before. What did you learn? He and Ranrock were close once, but they had a falling out. You believe he can be trusted? Ah, <sighs> difficult to say. He seemed trustworthy. Difficult to know, really. But Sorona Ryan trusts him. Well, that's something, I suppose. Supposing he can be trusted, 
Will he help us get to Ranrock? I retrieved a stolen helm. He hopes to return to Ranrock in order to regain his confidence. You have been busy. Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. Lord Gok did mention that Ranrock is searching for something, but he couldn't say what. Perhaps that helm will yield some answers. Ranrock is searching for something? I feared as much. I've heard an unusual amount of activity, goblins and wizards, I surmise, when visiting my portrait at my castle. Rookwood Castle? My former residence, yes. That castle is also the location of your next trial. Hmm. You didn't see anything? Speak with anyone? I did not. In fact, I did not make myself known. I only recently returned there and did not recognize nor trust anyone that I heard. I stayed out of sight so as not to tempt my portrait's destruction. I'm sorry to tell you that Victor Rookwood, evidently your descendant, is a dark wizard in league with Ranrock. My descendant? A dark wizard? I'm afraid we've no time to waste. Despite the obstacles that clearly await you, you must get to Rookwood Castle immediately. Not only is it the location of the next trial, it is home to a source of power that would be devastating in the wrong hands. I do wish we had the luxury of time. However, I do not doubt your abilities. Find my portrait there as soon as you can. Very well, sir. I'm on my way. Best of luck. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. I don't trust Ranrock, I'll tell you that. He'll tell me oh, over yes. here. <laughs> over here. What's going on here? Professor Rookwood was right. The place is crawling with Victor Rookwood's lot and Ranrock's loyalists. They're working together all right, but it is not a friendly alliance. I'm sure you'll agree that we need to find a way in other than the front gate. Let's go. All right, so I want to do something real quick. I want to go to, to this, and I want to put all of my, all of my red spells. I need to unlock this one. And then, actually, hold on. Yeah, and then all of my purple spells on my secondary. So that's gonna be that. That. Um, unfortunately, I don't have the other spells. So for my third, I can do... All right. Cool. Something like that. I will do for this one. I'll do. I'll keep that one. Maybe else. It's just better to cycle through. I just need to unlock more spells, which we will. Do we want to do all this. It does sound easier. Let's do this. Hey, what is it? Aha! Fuck. That works really nice. That works really, really nice. Your magic will now stop the likes of us. Oh. You can't stop Renrock's rebellion! Look at this dork. Okay, you got that little. Expelliarmus. Come here. Oh, damn! Look at Professor Fig backing me up! I like it. This guy's still alive, man. Come on, don't be pathetic. One more goblin and we complete the challenge. Okay, so we're gonna get this. I knew that was gonna come in handy. Jump up here and uh, 
uh, I think we are ready to rock and roll, uh, baby. If I'd known your plan was to dig up half the I country... I wouldn't have to dig if you could simply manage to bring me the child. We wouldn't need the child if you hadn't sent a dragon to retrieve the container I spent months and countless ministry favors tracking. You let them board the carriage. My options were limited once I knew it would be inconveniently beyond my reach at that infernal school. Have you not acquired enough power here? I allowed you to tunnel under my family home. Allowed me? You are here only because you are descended from a Keeper and may at some point inadvertently become valuable. We had an agreement. I will share with you the power that I discovered if you locate the stores of magic that are yet to be found. Hmm. So, unless you want another demonstration of my power, a power that you one day hope to wield, bring me the child. We already knew they were after you, but now we know they're digging for stores of magic. And Ranrock knows about the Keepers. Yes, I caught that too. Professor Rookwood said that you'd understand more once you complete the next trial. Let's get into that castle. Mm. Wow. Any special words you want me to pass on to your mum? Disarming chant or disarming. Uh, I forgot what they were called now. I'm going to bring from here. Sorry. Enhancements. Oh, nice. Fool. Excellent. Revelio. Gotta be more of them right here. Whoa! Oh, sorry, Fig. I thought, I thought you were. I suppose yeah, that's sorry the quick about way that. Is there something to those symbols? There we go. Woohoo! Are we gonna do this with Fig? Goblin Rebellion. They're a step ahead of us. Let's see where they lead. Oh, what the hell? Reby. This must be it. The store of magic and the source of Ranrock's power. Whoa. It looks empty. If they've taken all of it, 
why are they still here? Branrock said there's more to be found, and if he's right about that, it may or may not be located here. Wherever it is, we need to find it before they do. Where is that portrait? Man, this is this is crazy that I can't. I gotta empty out so much. Oh look, this one's better. This one just has a increased damage with incendio. So I'm not gonna change it just yet. Um better defense. Yeah, this is a little a little difficult to to start taking things out now because I mean the differences are very minimal. I heard something. Rebellion. I was hoping that was you. Oh, hello there. Professor Rookwood, the goblins and dark wizards who've overrun your castle are digging for stores of magic and have broken open some sort of container. No, things are more dire than I could have imagined. If, as you told Percival, a goblin in his vault was wielding a powerful magic, then they have somehow learned. It cannot be. And sir, they know you were a keeper. Ranrock used the term. This makes no sense. How did... We shall discuss this later. Right now, you must complete the next trial. Just tell me where I need to go. The power you stand to wield must first be fully understood. The trials will ensure that. Power without knowledge is dangerous indeed. In the wrong hands, we will simply have to outwit Ranrock. And my unfortunate namesake. Very well, Professor. Tell me where I need to go. I shall reveal the path. Professor Fig must leave you now. Rebellion! No. Goodbye, Fig. Goodbye. All right, let's freaking do this, bro. I would join you let's if go. I could. I shall await your arrival in the map chamber. The second trial. Well, this is going to be interesting. Ooh. Look at here. Look at here. Revelio. This looks nice, man. So that door is pretty massive. I'm assuming we'll come back down here eventually and open that up. Hmm. Okay, first puzzle of the day. Um. Rebellion. Whoa, what the heck? Revelio. Oh, what the hell? Here. And now I'll go back this way. And then I'll grab this one. Put it there. Yeah, it's got to be kind of like in the middle. Or not. <laughs> Alright, never mind. <laughs> Alrighty. We're good. I'm ready for battle, baby. Let's go. Bring it. Whoever want it, bring them. Rebellion. the heck? I am tripping out. Alright, so we're we going through here. That I pillar suppose. is blocking the path. I'll need to move it. But how? 
Man, this is so freaking trippy. It's like, what is going on? Revelio. Okay. What the hell? Oh my gosh. Stop confusing me. Oh, that's a big boy right there. Unfortunately, he's not big enough. Alright, but his wounds are. Incendio. Accio. Really? That hit me? What the heck? No, wrong one. Should have used that on the big guy, not the little one. I am an idiot. And that's all they wrote. They just they just got destroyed, man. Absolutely hideous. They ought to be embarrassed. Hmm. Cool. I like that. Um, okay, how do I do this? Here? Well, I think I'd hit this. And follow this. Possibly. Okay. Revelio. I believe ah. we need to proceed to the left here. How? Yes. What is this? We just did it. Oh, there we go. Revelio. Revelio. Right, we have another pillar here. There we go. Oh, that was a little annoying. I don't even know how I figured that out, to be honest. If you put me here there again, I'm just not figuring it out, right? This is not happening. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Revelio. But we're here. Ancient magic is nothing to play with. Is that it? Revelio. Nice, man. Holy smokes. Revelio. Something back there? That's where we came. Came from there, but what's over here? What in the world? Oh, this is different. I thought we were supposed to go forward. Okay. Let's see what this is all about. Revelio. Revelio. Bro, what in the world? That is cool. Alright, this 
looks important here. This looks like it's about to go down. I like it. Yep, we're getting the good old little potions. Got 24 potions. I don't even know we can hold that many. One of them is in another dimension, therefore I can't. That is comical as shit, man. Wow, unbelievable. Wow, you are just absolutely incredible, aren't you? Get out of town, man. Can we push this man into the next? There it is. That's it. No. No, not Levi Elsa. Not a fair That was freaking awesome. But now we've got the big boy. Destroy the orb as it's charging up. This is crazy.
continue exploring Charles Rockwood's trial. I'm what a relief. You know, I want to go home. Maybe I think maybe I think we've had enough here. I just gotta go back to let's sleep until the next season arrives, you know, something like that. Revelio. See the memories. What do we have here? Isidore's travels. Do come in. Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father... These are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. What have you done? I took his pain. This is uncharted magic, Isadora. You can only see what has been sealed in the jar, and we do not know what power that may hold. But the traces of that magic are different from what I've seen before. Thank you. Wow. Wow. My gosh. Oh, I cannot wait to see the next memory now. Like, I, I knew it was something... She was so obsessive with that idea of her father's pain being taken away. It's, God, what's gonna end up happening in the next two trials? Only time will tell. That was nutty. That was nuts. Hmm. You're back. I did yes. one piece, no less. Yes, we are back. It is good to see you again. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate that someone so competent is following this path. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep the second artifact safe as you've advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? What was the glowing strand that Isadora pulled from her father's chest? It was... Pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. Hmm. Okay. I'm ready for whatever comes next. In that case, introductions are in order. Allow me to introduce former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. Hmm. How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've always believed Hogwarts students capable of anything they set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of your next trial. 
We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of... Well... A vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Of course. Professor Fitzgerald needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. If you learn more about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. Very well, Professor. Oh boy. I know, I know. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully you will soon hear from Lodgok as well. And we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. Oh, it's not it's winter time. Yep, just as I expected. <laughs> That's awesome, bro. Oh man, this is gonna be so cool. fellow companions and teachers and alike. I was only level 20, defeating level 22 is... I must say that was rather impressive. Let's see if we have anything coming in here. Natty told me about your run-in with the poachers. I have some news about them as well. Can you meet me soon? I fear that some of what I uncovered has to do with you. Hmm. Interesting. That might be the quest we did when I played this early access. What quest do we have here? We also have to go to the room of requirement. Fire and vice. Yep. That's the one. And we will be stopping... The bad guys finally in this chapter which should take another three episodes or so but anyways guys i guess goodbyes are in order thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the story keeps getting a little bit deeper now i have now. been asked to teach you the exploding charm bombarda once you have completed the tasks i've set forth speak to me after class <laughs>